Hey everybody, it's Fat Frog. Today I want to tame up some angler fish. It was suggested that I do that for pearls, and I thought it would be cool because I haven't done it also in oh many many years. Um, so I got to clean up these crystals real quick and see what we got here. Um, we're doing just fine on pearls, though. However, let's unlearn, unlock all these things here. I better go to where I want to drop off these black pearls, though. And uh, yeah, but I thought it would be cool to get angler fish because it's been such a long time. Yeah, we'll just drop those in there for now. We'll open them up later. We've got tons of black pearls, but I also want to see how well they work for harvesting black pearls. I've never used them for harvesting black pearls. Okay, so I'm going to need some of my scuba gear. So luckily I've got some actually good uh, scuba gear here. We've got, uh, got a tank here with 200% uh, durability. And then there we go. Let's grab this one and this one i think we should be good that way and drop off my armor that i just got from the crystals so we'll drop that off in here still debating about whether or not i want to build an industrial grinder because i've got so much good stuff uh saddles and stuff that i'm never ever going to use so let's go grab our basilosaurus i can't remember if i have them oops going the wrong way if I have them still out here, yes, I do. Okay, so we'll park our little dude down here, and we're gonna go find one. I'm not gonna bring the whole darn shark army with me this time, um, but yeah, so let's go get our Basilosaurus and we'll get geared up here. And there we go, that should do it. Hop down into the water and begin our adventure. Where is our guy? Here it is. Okay, so let's go look in for some anglerfish. Oh, everybody's following me. Sorry guys, you gotta stay here this time. So it's taken some time to locate some anglerfish, but I found a whole pile of them here. I think there's five or six or so in this general vicinity. I think I've got everything cleaned out pretty good. Luckily, I remembered like as soon as I... Uh, left my little water base there that I had forgotten just about everything. So I brought, because I do think these guys are actually uh, an active tame. They're not a passive tame. So we've got to do a knockout here and I want to find, refine, there's a level 100 here and there it is. And then the rest of them are less than that. Oh, see, there's one guy gets through. And so I think I'm going to net it and then I am going to, oh, there's, yeah, there is six here. What's that one? Okay, we've got an Eurypterid too. Ugh. I don't like those guys at all. Let me zip around and knock this guy out real quick because, or take him out, because if I don't take him out, he's going to knock me out. So there, we got rid of that guy. Let's get ourselves in position here. Oh, somebody is charging up. Okay, it wasn't charging up. It was just dead and sparking. That's okay, cool. So let's knock this thing out and then get rid of the rest of these guys. There we go. So hopefully that will aggro the other anglers to get this lady knocked out here. So it does take regular kibble. At least that's what it says. I'm kind of wondering if this thing gets knocked out, if it's going to disappear. Trying not to overshoot this thing. Boy, it actually swims pretty darn quick. There we go. There's a good hit. I'm glad it's running already. Oh, did it stop? I think it might be asleep. Oh my god. No! Where did you guys come from? <sighs> okay, is there another one coming too? And another one's coming. Well, at least I didn't die. I don't know if they can zap this this thing or not. Let's take a look and see if it's knocked out. I don't even know if it's knocked out. Okay, taming effectiveness, 100%. Great. Now let's look around and see what's happening. Okay, cool. Weird. Very weird arc. Um, okay, so you should only take like five and then it should be... Oh, I can't use you underwater again. Uh, let's try this way. 
I forgot about that. I had all this elixir and now I can't use it. Um, I got one in my hot bar. Nope, can't use that. And that didn't work right. We did this, we did that, we did this. Okay, double click it. No, that's not gonna work. Uh, maybe just in my inventory here. That just went into a hot bar. Yep, okay. Well, whatever. So this thing's going to tame up, I hope. Um, the torpor is going pretty quick on it, isn't it? Oh man, did I should have brought some narcotic, but I oh I got some narco berries from all these uh, shark battles and stuff. So okay, cool. So I'm going to hang around here and see what I can do. Oh no, come on, Ark! What the heck? You guys weren't even around. Leave my angler fish alone. Oh my gosh, what the heck? All right, uh, where are you going, buddy? You're taking off on me now. So the one I just tarp uh, netted and everything, that one was kill. You guys weren't here a second ago. <laughs> Go away. All right, let's cryopod you. Hopefully before these jellies get here. Uh, okay, never mind. Jellies are pretty much here. They, I did not see those a second ago. I think they've just appeared. Maybe I'm just having a bad day. It's underwater. It's arc. I always have a bad day underwater. Okay. Are you going to stop swimming away now? Good thing I'm leaving the trace on you because you just want to get away. Okay, you stop now? Okay, now I'm cryopotting you. Wow, you lost a lot of health, buddy. A lot of health. Good thing I saw that right away. Because otherwise you'd be dead. You ate all the darn meat. And what is all of these things over here? There's a whole bunch of bags. I don't know what that's all about. It looks like, um, by the way, we had two more guys spawn in. This might be from a shark battle or something like that. That I had a lot of, a little while ago and I forgot about. Because we're not... No, that would have... Well, I don't know. Whatever. This is weird. <laughs> All right, let's go see what these two anglers are that either just spawned in or they came back or whatever happened. Those might have swam away from before. Okay, so it's 85 and a 55. And I think those guys are new. But we're going to get rid of them and try to get some new anglers to spawn in here. Oh, there's another angler. 15. Okay, so the other one, it looked like it only ate um, one kibble so we should be pretty good didn't need any of the narco berries so we're gonna see what's happening okay I found a level 145 male so there's a lot of anglers in this general vicinity and as soon as I get that one knocked out and everything I will share the location with you guys here on Fjordor okay if I can find him again so he ran off or swam off rather this way Oh, man. <laughs> I gotta stop complaining. Okay. So went off this way. Hopefully not too far. I think that's him with his head sort of in the sand up there. I've got a bunch of Eurypterids on me now. I think. Well, at least one, two. It's more than I want. Oh, and eels. My gosh. Go away. I'm just trying to tame an angler fish and make it my friend. Okay, are we done now? Nope, not yet. Okay, I think I see another one up there. Are we done? Okay. So let's get real close up here. I think we're safe-ish. Okay, so, harpoon. <laughs> Harpoon gun with a net. All right, we're down. And what's that? Oh, it's another angler. Okay. There's two anglers up there, actually. So let me just fire a bunch of arrows in here real quick. And then now let's get in a little closer. Hopefully we can do this. This would be great. This is the exact kind of fish that we want. How many harpoons do I have left? Or rather nets. I got five nets left, so... 
Just gotta keep an eye out for danger here. Shoot him in the tail. So other one's kind of waking up here. I think it's gonna be okay though. Five, four, three, two, one. Is that one hundred percent? That one's a hundred percent. Hey, there we do. There we do. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's do that. Give them five of those guys. Let's get away from them real quick. And let's grab a couple of stacks of meat here. There we go. Okay. Then we can go see what those other anglers are. Got some donkey over here. Donkey's really chill, which is fine by me. Okay. I know you're out here, guys. Somewhere. All right, other one tamed, excellent. Probably gonna get murdered right away, but that's okay. Okay, here's some more electric fish. Did I get the second one? I did. And here's a third and a fourth. It's all gonna be okay, they are dead. All right, other anglers, where'd you go? I bet you they took off. Hopefully that was a game save. That would be good. Oh, I think I see anglers over here. There's one. Uh, level 25. I don't know what that is. Oh shoot, I hit the donkey. Dang it. It's dead? I guess it was a level 15. Interesting. Are there two there? It looks like there's two. There's definitely two. All right, so get this guy, 25 and a 20. Okay, so let's show you guys where we're at on the map here and GPS. So we're at 71, or excuse me, 78.1 degrees latitude and 57.8 degrees longitude. And we're seeing quite a lot of anglers over here. So that is good to know. Those two are gone. Now let's check, I'm gonna put the trace on our other guy here. All right. Oh, there's another another angler. Did I just see an electric eel? There we go. Okay. There's an angler. Oh, there's a couple of them. Cool. So 45 and a 45. So we can get rid of those dudes. Oh, there's two of them here. 45 and a 20. Okay. All right, finally, we got our guy is teamed up here. Teamed up at level 217. Making sure that donkey's not after us. Okay, where'd he go? There he is. And our other one also teamed. We've got him picked up. Let's grab you. Where'd you go? Dude, 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 what the fridge? Get back here. Oh my gosh, what the frick? Why did he... Why did he bolt? Come back to me. He is taking off like a shot. Get out of my way, corals. Where is he going? Is he going to the center of the earth? What? Oh, no, he's in trouble. Look at him go. Nothing tacked him. Are you kidding me? Come on. I hope this guy has stam. Oh my gosh, she's going to get fried. There we go. Finally got... Oh no, 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 Come on. Okay, jellies are coming in. Get rid of these guys. Go away, Nardaria. Okay, are we going to be all right now? Wow, what the hell? I just took stuff out of his inventory and then he took off. Okay, okay. Get in here. All right, you're down to a less quarter of a health or less. And yes, whew. Wow. Man, I don't understand this here. Let's eat some food. Okay, let's take a look at that stats of that guy. Um, so we got level 149 female. Kind of interested in weight here. Uh, so 511. 
And 142, okay, 217 angler has 581. So not a huge difference. Um, so we might as well probably breed those. We're going to definitely look around, though, for some more. They're, they're, I think they're spawning in, but there's definitely more around here for sure. So there's a level 50 and a 90. And those guys are taking off for some reason, so we're going to eat those guys uh, real quick here. But man, I don't know why that thing took off so fast. And there's another one wedged up in the wall there. Uh, let's see, yeah, another 50. So we want something in that 140 range. Um, and I think a female, right? Yeah, because we got the 145 male. Is that correct? Let me double check that guy. Yep. That was 217 now, male. So, okay, let's see if we can find a nicer level female. Oh, I didn't have to go too far, I guess. So that is a 140 female. Let's go get her. Oh. There we are. And I am really afraid, and I think for very good reason. All right, let's just shoot four in here real quick. Succession. And then we'll slow down. Okay, let's get a little closer so we can read it out. So many electric eels. I don't know how this would be possible without a basilosaur or at least having a tribe mate like running patrol around you as you did this. To try to clear those out. There's so many things that can knock you out. The jellies, the eurypterids, and uh, and the electric eels, of course. So I'll try not to kill this thing. She is pretty bloody. Oh, good. Okay, so let's just do... should just be three and that. And, well, I did five, but let's get out of here. <laughs> let's give her some space. Oh, we got a... We got a point in our basilosaur. That's going to go into melee for sure. And let's put the trace on. And I think this is going to be the last one we're going to tame then. Unless we just happen to cruise around in a circle here and find something, you know, in the same range. Then uh, like a 140-ish male or female. We'll take either one. Take a look down here for crabs. That's where I got all my organic polymer by the way there are some of those guys and they're kind of stuck in this rock so they're not hard to kill i don't know about taming one of them it probably might be easy to it's a nine I'm, my weight is pretty full so i can't get any more um, by the way this cool crystal with this uh, wooden ship and everything is at 76.7 degrees latitude and 62.8 degrees longitude Okay, we've got this little lake here in the redwoods, which has a bunch of silica pearls. If you guys are interested, oh, we got water lilies. Hey, they're actually done right. A bravo to the devs. Okay, um, get my little geeky biologist thing out of the way, and we are at 27.0 degrees latitude and 83.4 degrees longitude over here in the sort of the southwest portion of the redwood forest. Okay. Let's put those guys away and let's get our guy out here in the cryopod, our little lady. There we are. So there should be some silica pearls around here somewhere. I see some shining. I don't think there's like piranhas in here. Um, that would be about the only thing. So let's just add weight. Okay, weight's 556 right now, so gobble. 313 silica pearls in one bite. That's pretty crazy. So our harvest rates here are 2.5. I think they're 2.5x. Or no, they're three. And I forgot to put my scuba tank on. There we go. Just have to try not to accidentally hit one of these saber-tooth salmon, and I think we're going to be pretty safe here. So let's gobble up these pearls. I don't want to get too shallow because I don't want to get stuck. I don't think that'll be a problem, but... It's not worth grabbing one pearl here. So this was suggested by one of our, one of my uh, viewers here. So I'm pretty, pretty happy about getting information from you guys in general. So 
Mr. Kennedy, thank you very much. And look at all those guys. Okay, so did I get all the pearls except for that one real shallow one? I think so. I want to see what kind of damage this thing does. So if I can get... Are there any coelacanths around here? Don't see one. I want to see what damage this thing is doing. But I don't want to aggro all of them if the damage is really bad. Okay, here's one. So 138 we're doing with this one. That's not too bad. Not too bad at all. So, oh, we got three points here from harvesting and whatnot. So melee damage was 461 on this guy. 461%, which seems pretty darn good um, without adding anything to it. So, yeah, so we got all of our pearls. And let's count them up. Let's go close to our... Where is our Argentavis friend? Thought it was over here. Maybe it got to get attacked by something. That would kind of stink. Oh, there it is. Okay. So let's just actually hop off here and then we'll transfer everything and get you out of the water and then we'll count. Okay. So I actually brought out the calculator there <laughs> 5,056 silica pearls. And so between that and the gachas, I don't think we'll ever need silica pearls. Uh, again, so I'm going to do a where are the silica pearls uh, location video here in Fjordor probably in the next couple of days. And when I do get to that, I will put a link in the description for that video in case you're curious about some of the best places to get silica pearls on this map. But for now, there's just that one. Um, I want to test this out and see how it does with black pearls um, down in the abyssal cave. So let's do that. All right, here we go, straight down. Make sure everybody's following me. I think I brought five along, so maybe it was six. I don't know, so it's usually less than I normally bring. I usually bring like eight or up to 10 going down to this cave, just so we can shred the number of Moses around here, which is pretty insane. So I think we're just gonna avoid the very deep here and head over which I think is straight across uh, to the big skeleton that's on top. That's a leads. That's not a problem. Well, here's the skeleton. But we need where the skeleton doesn't really have the big depths below. Got a couple of Moses. Let's head straight to this one, take it out. I feel like I've done enough videos of this little area, but we got to get rid of this dude and get him dead. There we go. And oh my gosh, we got three right behind us here. Come on, guys, let's get them. I don't know how we would do this without the shark pack. I just don't know. Don't think it would work out well at all. Okay, there we go. So these guys are doing tons of damage as usual. Um, we've been getting a few more points into melee with every time we come down here. So these sharks are getting better and better. Okay, so... Now we've got this dude. Hopefully that's the last one. At least for a little while. Come on, go away. Those are my sharks. That's good. These guys seem like they're on passive or something. They're not doing squat. Let me just whistle... Attack my target. There we go. And let's see if there's any black pearls underneath here. Doesn't look like it. Oh, there's one. At least everybody dead. Okay, so let's throw out the anglerfish now. Where are you, buddy? There you are. And let's throw this out. I don't know how many we're going to take with us, but we're going to go straight up weight on this dude. Dude lady. Okay, so we got four here. I want to make sure everybody's following me now. There. Oh, yeah, we can't get black pearls. All right, so... Thought we might be able to, but we can't. So, oh well. It's worth checking it out. I know there's black pearls here. So, yeah, there's a, and there's a ton of them. How many am I going to get if I just harvest them with my hands here? Let's put away that cryopod. I'm getting 47. So, again, 3x rates. We could get many hundreds, I think, um, from down here. Okay, so let's pick up this thing again. And I think uh, since I'm here, I'm going to go attack anything. Hopefully we'll find like a, 
alpha and can get some runes and stuff like that. But I think I'll meet you guys back at the base. Let's hatch some anglerfish eggs so we have some good ones in tow here. Put my flippers on and drop down here. Okay, cool. So here's our little parents and should be hatching pretty quickly here. Nope. Let's see, I gotta drop these. I'm treating them like they are cryopods. Are they hatching? They are hatching. So we should have three of them. They're all kind of stacked on each other here. There we go. And whoa, I'm, fly I'm swimming quickly here. There we go. Let's uh, have them follow me just a little bit. Kind of separate them out a little. There we go. Oh, that's a purple one. That's cool. I wonder if it has a mutation or not. Let's uh, take a look here. Yep, one has a mutation. Don't know what in yet, but we'll figure that out. That's cool. Oh, wait. Oh, there's twins. Maybe. Here, let's get it to follow. There we go. Twins. Nice. This one. There we go. Cool. Unfollow those guys. Well, I think that should be it for today. Pretty cool with the anglerfish. Um, finally kind of figured them out and uh, with their fleeing business and all that kind of stuff. Awesome. Just totally awesome at collecting silica pearls. I knew they were, but I didn't know they were quite that good. Black pearls, can't harvest them. That's okay. Uh, they're easy enough to pick up by hand, but there's no kind of multiplier, which I guess that makes sense. They'd be kind of OP otherwise. So, guys, hope you enjoyed it. If you have, of course, thumbs up, all that good stuff. We'll see you next time.